This episode is sponsored by Easy Access Technologies, your one-stop shop for security systems, CCTV, access control, automated gates, and more. Give us a call today for a free estimate, serving Washington County and surrounding counties. Los Patrones in Burton, Texas. It's a small town. I'm here with the owner, Lily, and she has got the best customers. They are busy tonight. You would think that it would be kind of slow because of the coronavirus. Not happening. It's not slow. There's a lot of people. I listen to them answering the phone. There's to-go orders. They got a lot going on. What do you have to say about it, Lily? I am so excited. We <laughs> finally got to open. It took us a whole year to do it, but we're here. And just the support has been so amazing. I'm just very happy. We're busy. Um, it's good food, good service, like she said. Um, so yeah, come out. In, Join us. In Burton, Texas. In and, Burton, Texas. And you're the only Mexican restaurant in Burton, Texas, yes. right? Yes, I'm the only one here. Uh -huh. And then let me just tell you something. They have the best margaritas I have ever tasted in my life. They're so good. Is that like the most popular drink? You know what? It is. It's the most popular It's a popular drink. Um, it's a family recipe, so uh -huh. we can't really say what we have in there, but they're, they're actually really good, so yes. I feel like I almost ordered a strawberry daiquiri, but I was like, you know what? If I'm going to go to Los Patrones, I'm going to get the margarita. I can't get anything but the margarita. great food uh, any message you want to give to your customers you know really? I'm just so thankful uh, for that good support you know everybody coming out here and supporting us um, I know it's a bad timing to open uh, but yeah thank y'all so much we wish them nothing but the best thank you for your amazing service and thanks for being here oh, we hope you have you. awesome uh, future ahead of you and I'm sure you will and thank you so much oh, thank you guys <laughs> Los Patrones in Burton, Texas. I brought my friend Amanda because I had such a good experience here yesterday with my little family. Los Patrones here in Burton really has it going on. They have such a nice restaurant. Um, you'll see in Lily's interview that she said that it took them a year to open and you can see why. The inside is so nice. Everything's so clean and just the restaurant is beautiful. The atmosphere is amazing and even here we're on the patio it's quiet there's nice scenery behind us to enjoy the music they have playing is just like hit after hit after hit it's just a fun environment i feel like this place would be an amazing hangout for the people of burton maybe some karaoke nights here or some like just fun little parties it's just the this is the place to be in Burton, that's for sure. Hands down. Okay, this is how this is how much I support small businesses. Is I just came here yesterday and I'm here again today and I brought a friend. So that's how supporting small business goes. What you think about your margarita? Let us know. Tell everybody what you got. I got a sangria margarita. So tequila and wine. Both in there? Of course. <laughs> of course. Okay. The lime's in there already, but yeah. Okay. Great stuff. And I got a peach margarita. It's a small one. Okay, so trying out my peach marg. It's really good. I think I like the mango. Mango, mango, <laughs> one better. But I still like the peach one too. Very good, very tasty. So, very peachy. Peachy keen. <laughs> Let's talk about small businesses. Let's talk about the, the purpose of my show. So I started this show in efforts to kind of bring some attention to the small businesses in the area, which I'm doing now. We're having fun at Los Patrones here in Burton, Texas. Come check them out. It's a great environment, great uh, customer service. They're just nice all around. 
But the purpose of my show originally is to just kind of highlight small businesses and it's something I am passionate about as a small business owner. Uh, I co-own Easy Access Technologies with my husband and he just he puts in security cameras. I send the invoices for the security cameras he puts in and do all the paperwork. So we're a good team. I enjoy working with him. And then my dad also has his small business, which is Ram Optical, and then also Top Four Cars. He co-owns that with my with our family friend Carlos. So I'm just surrounded by small businesses, small business owners. It's something I am passionate about, and I feel like I need to highlight the small businesses in the area that deserve this attention. So, what do you think? What are some of your favorite well, small like, businesses? Well, like I. I'm probably not as passionate about small businesses, but I will say that majority of the time when I go somewhere, I have the most fun slash the best experience at a small business. Why? Just because I feel like it's just so welcoming. I feel like they give you a little bit more like, they make you feel like appreciated, appreciated whenever you go there. Like I can consider all my experiences compared to like when I go like to Applebee's or Chili's and I'm like, hey, they, they, they don't just, care, they if, you don't care don't if you don't go. And then like some places I can go to and believe it or not, there's some places I can go to and they, they know who I am. Some places. They they know are places you know, and it's just like it feels it feels welcoming and I mm -hmm. like it. So um, I'm all about, you know, supporting small businesses. You know, especially when it comes to food. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean they, they make some good food. I mean like anywhere I usually go. They take more pretty time. good. You can tell like you know? they take more time. Yeah. They need you. Like, they're not like a multi-million dollar corporation. They are your neighbors. They're your <laughs> friends here locally that mm -hmm. they need your business to survive. Exactly. The money that you spend at their business, it's not going to some CEO or whatever. Yeah. Like that money goes to the small business owner's family. And then that in turn gets poured back into the community. So that's why small businesses are so important. That's why I am passionate about supporting small businesses and I just applaud small business owners. It's a lot of hard work. So that's why I have my show. That's why the Karina Show exists. And the Karina Show keeps going because I have a great time doing it and meeting new people. And I love eating. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. That's the end of the Karina Show. We're done for today. I had my friend Amanda here as my guest. If you liked her on my show, please let me know in the comments. If you don't like her, then that's okay. Let me know in the comments when we won't have her again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'd rather y'all not say anything. I'm you know. just kidding. <laughs> so if you liked having her, let me know. She's a great girl. She's a nice person. Um, <laughs> no, but yeah, we're done here. We're gonna leave and go home, and that's a wrap, guys. Thanks for watching the Karina Show. Tune in next week where we talk about more important things and visit other small businesses here in the community. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Gig'em!